a malfunctioning turbine is both tumultuous and terrifying. Here are the top 10 wind turbine fails. Number 10. The Fire Failure of Klickitat County, July 2019 When a wind turbine fails, the consequences can be dire. And the turbine fail that happened in Klickitat County, Washington in July 2019 is a testament to that. The wind turbine's generator caught fire, causing sections of the turbine to melt. At first, the fire was 300 feet in the air, but these melted pieces fell to the ground where they ignited the surrounding grass. The burning grass then started a massive wildfire. This wildfire, known as the Juniper Fire, made headlines as high winds and dry conditions forced the fire to spread. It wasn't long before the Juniper Fire had burned up 300 acres. Firefighters were finally able to get the fire under control, but the failure of this wind turbine caused extensive damage to the surrounding area. Number 9. The Tehachapi Turbine Failure On May 2, 2009, a wind turbine began to spin out of control. The turbine was in the Tehachapi area near Highway 58 at the Sand Canyon Road intersection. The turbine was only 1,400 feet from the highway so when it started spinning, the highway was closed down. The blades of the turbine spun so quickly that onlookers couldn't even see them. The turbine was owned by AES Company, and it's not known what caused the failure. Employees were helpless as the blades spun. They were told that the only way to stop it was to wait for the wind to die down. If the turbine had broken apart, it could have become very dangerous, which is why the highway remained closed until the turbine was under control. Number 8. The Fenner Wind Farm Failure There are 20 wind turbines located on the Fenner Wind Farm in Madison County, New York. But on December 27, 2009, one of the wind turbines suffered a catastrophic failure. The turbine, which weighed 187 tons, fell into the middle of a field. Experts were brought in to investigate. The wind farm was shut down while the investigation was underway. The turbines were reinforced with steel foundations and truckloads of cement, and the wind farm was soon reopened. But a formal report was never released, so no one knows what caused this massive turbine to succumb to such a failure. Number 7. The Broken Blades of Perkins High School In January 2009, a wind turbine at Perkins High School in Ohio failed when a blade became detached. The blade dislodged from the rotating hub, and a nearby parent who saw the failure quickly called the school authorities. Luckily, school was not in session at the time, and no one was hurt. But parental concern grew, as this was the second time in two years that a wind turbine at the school had failed. There are three turbines at the school, and only a little while earlier three blades broke free from a different turbine, causing fiberglass to fly in all directions. The wind turbines are manufactured by Redriven Power Inc. of Iroquois, Ontario. They inspected the turbines, but claim that they don't know why these turbines have failed not only once, but twice. Number 6. The Puzzling
The Netherlands is no stranger to windmills or windmill accidents, but when a massive wind turbine caught on fire in October 2013, the tragedy was felt nationwide. The failure happened at the Delta Winds Piet de Witt wind farm. The top of the turbine caught on fire and trapped two mechanics. The two mechanics, who were only 19 and 21 years old, were at the top of the turbine for routine maintenance when the failure occurred. Firemen and emergency services were quickly called to the scene, but the fire, which was caused by a short circuit, was too high for the firemen to reach. The firemen had to bring in a crane, but by the time they managed to get the fire under control, it was too late. Both mechanics lost their lives in the turbine failure, and the incident caught fire in the media. Experts and wind turbine employees claim that accidents and turbine failures are actually quite common, but that nobody has been paying any attention to them. They claim that the media needs to focus on these types of accidents to make the public aware of just how dangerous wind turbines can be. Number 1. The Haunting Hornslet Wind Turbine Failure When a wind turbine was making strange noises on February 22, 2008, engineers were called to the scene to assess the turbine. The engineers confirmed that the strange noises were being caused by worn brakes. They fixed the brakes and planned for further inspection at a later date. The turbine was restarted. But when the wind picked up, the turbine began making strange noises again. Personnel turned on the air brakes at the top of the turbine to try to control the blades. But the blades began to spin like crazy, and they couldn't control the speed of the rotors. Fearing catastrophe, the entire tower was evacuated and the police were called in. The police secured a huge area around the tower to ensure that no one was in the vicinity of the turbine should it break apart. The turbine continued to spin out of control and only two and a half hours after the strange noises had started again, the entire turbine failed. The blade completely disintegrated and debris from the disintegrated blade was tossed hundreds of feet into the air. The event was caught on camera by men from a nearby farmhouse and the haunting footage of this colossal fail went viral on the internet. However, it was the first failure caught so eloquently on camera. The turbine was fixed and was put back into operation in June 2008, but nearby residents are still unsettled by the potential danger of the nearby wind turbines. The epic fail of the Vestas turbine and the fact that it was caught on camera has earned this wind turbine failure the top spot on this list of top 10 wind turbine fails.